In the history of mankind, there is a huge amount of evidence about men and women with incredible height, but only in the last two centuries have scientists and doctors been able to understand the reason for this unique phenomenon. This disease, called gigantism, is caused by a pituitary tumor that stimulates excessive secretion of growth hormone. Such people can be found even today, striking in their height and size. These giants have a difficult time starting with everyday problems and ending with big health problems. In this episode, we will tell you about the tallest people who have gone down in history. Sultan Kosin is an ordinary Turkish farmer who is the tallest man on our planet. Yes, this achievement is certified by experts from the Guinness Book of Records. The height of the Turkish giant is an incredible 2 meters and 51 centimeters. The Sultan himself notes that he is not very happy about this phenomenon. Their large height makes it difficult to walk, so he has to use crutches. In addition, a man needs a special bed, clothes, and shoes, and he can't get inside most cars. In addition, Kosin complains about problems with women. He didn't have a girlfriend until he was 26 because all women were scared off by his huge height. However, he noted that the appearance in the Guinness Book of Records would help him establish a personal life because the main dream of a humble farmer has always been family and children. The giant from Zytomir, Leonard Stagnik, whose height exceeded 2.5 meters, or rather 253 centimeters, was not a healthy person. After frostbite on the feet, he became a disabled person and underwent more than one brain surgery. At one time, he worked as a veterinarian on a collective farm, but for many years he had been running a household. The record holder wore clothes of the 70th size and ordered shoes of the 62 size at the Zytomir Prosthetic and Orthopedic Enterprise. Stadnik considered his height more of a problem than a point of pride. He was kind and helpful. In recent years, Stadnik has lived as a recluse, refused to meet with journalists, and wanted to live like all normal people. One hundred six years ago, on February 22, 1918, Robert Pershing Waldlow was born. He was the tallest man in the history of mankind. His height was 272 centimeters. At birth, he looked like an ordinary child, but soon, due to impaired pituitary function, he began to grow rapidly and by the age of one, he weighed about 20 kilograms and his height exceeded 90 centimeters. By the age of 8, Robert had outgrown his father, and at 9, he could easily carry him up the stairs. In 1938, the guy became the face of an international shoe company. They made shoes of the 75th size for him. However, unfortunately, the guy's rapid growth had a strong effect on his health. He died in his sleep at the age of 22. Bao Shi Shun from Mongolia was the tallest man on the planet until Leonid Stadnik became the new record holder. He entered the Guinness Book of World Records in 2005 with a height of 236 centimeters. Since then, he has traveled the world with other record holders. However, he was tired of being an exhibit. Bao decided to return home and start a family. Until the age of 16, Bao was no different from other kids. Then he began to grow really quickly. At the age of 23, he was already 2 meters 36 centimeters tall, and he stayed in the same state. On December 13, 2006, Bao Shi Shun, thanks to the length of his arms, 1.06 meters, saved two dolphins in the Royal Ocean World Park. He helped extract foreign bodies from their stomachs. Unlike most giants who unfortunately did not live to an old age, Bao is still alive, and he is 72 years old. The height of Brahim Takiola from Morocco is 246 centimeters. He was born on January 26, 1982 in the southern city of Gulmin. Brahim ranks second in the ranking of the highest living people. Brahim was born on January 26, 1982 in Morocco. Abnormal growth appeared starting at the age of 13. Brahim has the longest feet on the planet with a size of 38.1 centimeters. In addition, Brahim spends half the year in Paris and the other half in Morocco. 27-year-old Rumesa Gelgi from Turkey became the tallest woman in the world according to the Guinness Book of Records. 
Her height is 215 centimeters. The girl has a rare genetic disease, Weaver's syndrome, which causes rapid excessive growth during the entire growth period, along with abnormalities in the development of the skeleton and internal organs, in 85% with mental retardation. Due to mobility problems caused by her height, the Turkish woman is forced to move in a wheelchair or with the help of crutches. Because of Weaver's syndrome, she has special features, such as big hands and ears. Rumesa has undergone several surgeries due to her condition, as well as medical intervention to prevent her from growing any further. Elizane de Cruz Silva is recognized as the tallest girl in the world. Because of this, she is experiencing a number of health problems and also cannot move around the streets without protection. Elizane de Cruz Silva won the title of the tallest girl in the world 10 years ago. The Brazilian woman's height reaches 206 centimeters. For many years now, she has been in a relationship with Francinaldo da Silva Carvalho, who is as much as 43 centimeters shorter than her. Until 2021, the tallest man in the United States was Igor Vovkovinsky. His height was 2 meters 34 centimeters. In 1989, with his mother Svetlana and older brother Oleg, he emigrated to the United States where he became famous. It was there that they managed to raise funds for surgery and treatment, which Igor needed at that time. At the age of 7, Igor reached a height of 182 centimeters and weighed more than 90 kilograms. World fame came to Igor after he brought Zlata Ognovich, a participant in the Eurovision Song Contest 2013, on stage. Igor Vovkovinsky died in Minnesota at the age of 38 due to heart disease. If you haven't liked this episode yet, now is the best time to do it. Finn Vino, with a height of 2 meters 51 centimeters, even managed to serve in the army. From an early age, the guy developed normally, but after the age of 21, he began to grow due to a problem with the pituitary gland. Doctors observed the man and noted that his height increases every year. Vino was a very peculiar, intelligent, and kind person, as all his relatives and acquaintances said. The highest Finn lived for 54 years and died in 1963. Albert Kramer is the tallest man in the history of the Netherlands. His height was 2.42 meters. He lived an amazingly long life of 79 years and was married twice, but he didn't leave any offspring. Here's an interesting fact. His son-in-law suffered from dwarfism and did not exceed 69 centimeters. Together, they formed a variety band with performances all over the world. Don Kohler from the USA held the title of the tallest man who lived in the 1970s. He was 2 meters 49 centimeters tall and had a twin sister with a height of 1 meters 75 centimeters. Kohler can be seen in the photo above with the McWhirter brothers in 1974 during a trip to New York to make a film with David Frost for the Guinness World Records TV show. He died in 1981 in Chicago. Ulyana Semenova is a legend of Soviet sports, a woman who had not only fame and recognition, but also serious health problems. But despite this, she was never afraid of difficulties and always stepped forward to her dream. Semenova was a two-time Olympic champion and a three-time world champion in basketball. Her name is listed in the Guinness Book of Records as the tallest, 2 meters 10 centimeters, female basketball player. Jinat Ali was born in Bangladesh in 1996 in an ordinary family. He had two brothers and a sister. The parents claimed that the sharp growth began in childhood and continued even at the age of 23. Doctors predicted that Ali would continue to grow constantly, so his diet should consist of at least one kilogram of food daily to maintain the right muscle condition. Such a real volleyball giant lives in Iran. As a child, he suffered a life-changing injury. He injured his pelvis when falling from a bicycle. After that, the guy's body began to grow rapidly. There are almost 8 billion people on the planet, and 36-year-old Morteza Merzad is among the three tallest. 
at 279 centimeters, and together with the Iranian national team, he wins one title after another. He has already helped the team to win Olympic gold in sitting volleyball twice, and now he is prepared to go to the Paralympic Games in Paris. Robert Bobrotsky is a 23-year-old giant from Romania. At 8, the boy was already under 190 centimeters. By the age of 15, Robert had reached 220 centimeters. By his 18th birthday, Bobrotsky was 231 centimeters tall. He is a great example of healthy genetics. All thanks to his basketball player father, 21-year-old Masi Curran from Texas retained the title of the girl with the longest legs in the world according to the Guinness Book of World Records for the fourth year in a row. Her right leg is 135 centimeters long and her left leg is 134 centimeters long. This American woman with a phenomenal height of 208 centimeters even became a star of TikTok where she regularly tells fans about her life, including the difficulties she faces because of her height. A girl often has to bend down to walk through the door, and it's very difficult to find clothes in her size. She has to spend up to $250 on a pair of jeans alone. Romanian giant Georgi Mirasan was born in Romania in 1971. His official height is 231 centimeters, and in fact, he is the same height as another basketball player who is also often added to the top of the tallest people, Manut Bolon. However, according to some reports, Georgie's real height was 1 to 2 centimeters higher, so he is considered to be the tallest basketball player in the history of the NBA. Mirasan even starred in a movie called My Giant. Brock Brown, 27, from Michigan, was officially considered the tallest teenager in the world until he outgrew adolescence, but even after that, he did not stop growing. At the age of 17, the guy was already 2 meters tall and got into the Guinness Book of Records. At the moment, Brock's height is 233 centimeters, but he will continue to grow. In 2010, when Chinese woman Yao Difang was listed in the Guinness Book of Records, her height reached 2.33 meters, and at the time of her death in 2012, her height was 2.36 meters. The reason for the woman's incessant growth was a tumor. Yao weighed about 190 kilograms and her leg size was 79 centimeters. The shoes for her were specially made by the German shoemaker George Wessels. The cause of Yao's death was a brain tumor, while her family had no money to treat it. What a twist! Haven't you expected to see this either, have you? Dalip Singh Rana, also known as the Great Kali, is an Indian professional wrestler, actor, and powerlifter who won the Mr. India title in 1995 and 1996. Before joining professional wrestling, he was an officer in the Punjabi police. The Great Kali is one of the biggest wrestlers in the history of this industry. Kali, whose height is 216 centimeters and weight is 157 kilograms, is also considered the largest man in the history of powerlifting, which he has been engaged in for several years. Sun Ming Ming is a Chinese basketball player, one of the tallest players who has ever played professional basketball. The height of the Chinese is 235.5 centimeters, while the weight is 168 kilograms. He started playing basketball only at the age of 15 when he reached 2 meters and then came to the United States in early 2005 to prepare for a possible career in the NBA. In the summer of that year, Sun was diagnosed with a benign brain tumor attached to the pituitary gland, which is responsible for the production of growth hormone. The operation cost $100,000 and was carried out with money raised from donations. Fortunately, it was successful and saved his life. Have you heard not about the tallest, but about the heaviest people? John Minnick is known as the American who became the heaviest on the planet. Having poor health, he managed to live a fairly eventful life and raise heirs. 
At the age of 12, he weighed 133 kilograms. At the age of 22, 180 kilograms. By the age of 25, 317 kilograms. And by the age of 35, 442 kilograms. In fact, by the age of 37, John's weight reached approximately 635 kilograms, after which he was entered into the Guinness Book of Records. Doctors called John Minnick's disease incurable. In September 1983, during another stay in the hospital, the man died. This girl is 2 meters 6 centimeters tall and so strong that she can easily lift a man weighing 100 kilograms over her head and throw an adult man to the other end of the room. This is Lindsay Hayward from Miami and her 107 kilograms of clean muscles. In recent years, she participated in wrestling but was disqualified due to the fact that explicit photos of her appeared online. In 2007, Neil Fingleton was voted Britain's tallest man. He then moved to the United States to start a basketball career. Later, he began acting in films. In addition to the Game of Thrones, he can be seen in Doctor Who. The height of the giant is 2.32 centimeters. Fingleton also played basketball. He died in 2017 at the age of 37 from heart failure. Yao Ming is a Chinese basketball player, sports commentator, and president of the Chinese Basketball Association. He played for the Houston Rockets of the NBA as a central player. At the time of his NBA appearances, he was the tallest player in the championship with a height of 229 centimeters. Yao also became famous for being the prototype of a legendary meme that went viral on the internet. These rare shots from the very beginning of the 20th century depict John Rogan, one of the tallest people on the planet, as well as the tallest black man. His height was 267 centimeters. Even though he could not work, he earned his living by selling his portraits and postcards with his image at train stations. He refused all offers to participate in carnivals and slideshows. The disease hampered his ability to move and eventually made it impossible for him to walk, which led to the need to use a cart. One of the most famous giants of giants in the wrestling world of the 90s is Andre Rene Rusimov, better known as Andre the Giant. He was a real mountain with a height of 226 centimeters and weighing under 250 kilograms. He wore size 70 shoes and his hands were so huge that Andre used a pencil to dial numbers on a dial phone. Andre the Giant became a cult figure not only in wrestling, but throughout pop culture, and his life was full of crazy stories. If we talk about the most difficult people living, then the story of Juan Pedro Franco cannot be ignored. In 2016, the Guinness Book of World Records recognized him as the heaviest man in the world. When he was only six years old, he already weighed 63 kilograms, but an injury in adolescence only made the situation worse. And by the age of 17, he had grown to more than 228 kilograms. At the age of 31, he already weighed 595 kilograms. Because of his enormous weight, he couldn't leave his bed and it took eight people to move him. But through the incredible efforts of doctors and Juan himself, over the next three years, he managed to lose as much as 330 kilograms. Vikas Kumar Upal, also known as Vicky Upal, was the tallest resident of India. On January 12, 2004, the Tribune reported that Vikas was 251 centimeters tall and still growing. On June 10, 2005, a height of 268 centimeters was reported. He had palms 33 centimeters long and feet as much as 50 centimeters. He died on June 30, 2007, during an unsuccessful operation to remove a brain tumor in Delhi, India. Iranian Sajad Garibi, thanks to his huge and strong physique, has become a real internet phenomenon. His large muscle mass has even been compared to the Incredible Hulk from Marvel Comics. 
Sajad is 27, he is 188 centimeters tall and weighs 180 kilograms. These dimensions allowed him to collect more than 400,000 subscribers on his Instagram who are interested in following the daily life of the giant. To be honest, I'm speechless after witnessing it. What about you? Fifty-nine-year-old American arm wrestler Jeff Deeb is known not so much for his achievements in the world of sports, but for his incredibly huge and strong arms. The dimensions of his palms, wrists, and forearms are simply amazing. Giant hands could turn into the cause of serious complexes and shyness, but Jeff Deeb has been proud of his peculiarity since childhood and has achieved great success. Emmanuel Yarborough is the heaviest fighter in the history of MMA. He was born in the USA and by the age of 14 weighed 145.5 kilograms. To control his weight, Yarborough decided to resort to American football and wrestling, but he achieved the greatest success in judo, where he earned a brown belt and took silver at the US Championships. Emmanuel was rapidly gaining weight and even competed in sumo. He tried his hand at movies and even starred in Bollywood, but he ended up sadly. At the age of 51, he died of a heart attack, having failed to lose weight. What would the heroes in our video look like if their enormous height and weight hadn't led to their deaths? Well, we can't ignore the strongest and largest person today. Brian Shaw is an American strongman born in 1982 in the USA. Brian Shaw is 203 centimeters tall and his weight ranges from 190 to 200 kilograms. Brian Shaw is a four-time winner of the title of the strongest man on the planet.